And now Doc Aver wants to play a game. <laughs> and the two match, at least it's not a verse, a baked meme, as I call it. Your son. Exactly. Should she say anything special when she meets new people? She's not complaining about her, her uterus. Well, I guess back in the 1800s, having like 10 plus kids was nothing for pretty much any working class couple. That, that was practically nothing. It's like pff, eight kids, we got like 15 or whatever. I wonder which person in history had the app who holds the Guinness World Record for having given birth to the most babies in their lifetime. Or the, yeah, just had the most biological children. Whether that be the dad, the most amount of babies a guy has ever made, and the most amount of babies a woman has ever given birth to. to. I was trying to, like... I don't know. Usually when I talk about stuff, I, I kind of have a habit to use they, them pronouns a lot. Because obviously there's a chance that, like, you know, uh, like even if somebody gave birth to a child, you know, they could later identify or identify even at the time as non-binary, you know? So, yeah, I, I just try to believe that, you know, like, I'm not trying to give in to J.K. Rowling's belief that anybody who supposedly men menstruates supposedly can only be a woman or whatever and all that crap. So yeah, I just try to remain as gender neutral as possible. If that's the term. 
Like, you know, like, not everybody who's actually, like, physically given birth is not ever they're not all gonna just identify strictly as female, you know? So it's like, you know, I don't know, just not refer to them all as quote-unquote women, but, I don't know, just use they-them pronouns because obviously I wouldn't know absolutely all of their pronouns. You know, many of them, probably even most, may identify as women, but, you know, they may, some of them, a fair few may not, you know. <laughs> and her hair is clipping right through her husband's hat. It was right then. But yeah, just to respect everybody's pronouns, pretty much, was basically what that tangent was about. Aren't they all at one point? Kind of like how aren't they all obsessed with Big Bird at one point? Hence the one slide where they're wearing a, like a chicken costume or whatever. Kind of like Big Bird or whatever. Anyway, that'll probably be it for today. I got some bonus of just uh, doing ballet right then. And then... Oh, Turtle Man, Tumbling, Tumbling Turtle Man. Put that as a GIF on Tumblr. No, not really. 